right, Derek Blanc with Top MMA News here with uh, UFC fighter Jason Nadal. Jason, how are you doing? I'm doing well. Happy to uh, be back home in the Maritimes. Yeah, I said originally he's from uh, Pinto County, Nova Scotia. So what was the last time you were back in Nova Scotia? I came back last year for, um, for my sister's wedding, but uh, I paid for that trip, so it's nice to come back on somebody else's dollar. <laughs> Now, uh, coming back to Nova Scotia, now you do live outside, uh, it's just outside of Red Deer, I believe. Yeah, I live in Red Deer. Okay, so uh, is, there, is there a thing that you do when you come back? Like, is there like a maritime thing that you have to do like when you get off that plane? Like, like I know like for a few people, it's like, go get a Donero right away. Yeah. <laughs> or go have a key spear. Yeah. Uh, no, not, not for me particularly. There's no, I don't have a routine, but it's always nice to come home. And, you know, the first thing I do is call up all my old friends and try to, try to set up, you know, dinner something with them and get caught up on what's going on. Yeah, obviously you uh, probably won't have too much chance to do that this week and obviously a little busy uh, doing the work thing. So. Yeah, well, here at the corner, Ryan and Hans, so it's a bit busy, but um, always, you know, not that busy. It's more morning, Ryan will be resting, so hopefully I'll get caught up with my, with my friends, maybe over the coffee. So. Yeah. Now, uh, there's been an announcement this week that uh, you are going to be uh, dropping out of the uh, UFC 124 card coming up there. Now, I was reading on uh, Sports Center, it was uh, your ankle that you activated? Or? Yeah, just uh, the, the injury, my off. injury from the yeah, UFC in uh, Montreal, the one where I injured my ankle and had surgery on it. And, uh, I've been back training and was hoping to, to be a part of this next Montreal card, but it seemed, I picked up the intensity of the training and the, and the frequency, and, and the harder I train, the, the worse it's getting. So uh, I don't think it'll be, or I'm sure it won't be able to get me through a training camp. So uh, I was forced, you know, if you're not 100%, then you're not able to put 100% of your training camp, then uh, you shouldn't be taking fights in the UFC. Now, uh, do you have a timetable? Maybe like, uh, do you have a maybe timetable on how uh, the like, you know, Obviously, I know it's, it was a really bad injury. Go, obviously coming out, or at least it looked like on video. Well, I had surgery and had two plates put in and twelve screws, and uh, it, it's back healed. Uh, I'm back training. Last night I was over the red roll with TJ, and uh, so yeah, I'm back training and uh, training as hard as my ankle will allow me. I wish I had a, a date and a time when it, when it was going to be 100. percent But I'm just taking it. You know, I'm basically taking a week by week right now to, uh, you know, to see how it is and hopefully be back back in the octagon in the new year, early in the new year. Yeah. Obviously, busy man, fighter, trainer, <laughs> blogger, Case Vidal, again, uh, thank you very much. Have a good one. Best of luck to your fighter. Thank you.